Hi guys, welcome back to this brand new video. Today I'm going to show you my updated collection video about my 1 to 4 in scale collection. So yeah, let's get started. The first model we see here is this ANA Airbus A380 in the uh, orange turtle livery, I always call it like this, um, from GC Wings. So in the box we find this beautiful card with a lot of details about the aircraft and of course the aircraft itself. This is the aircraft, let's set it aside. The next model in my collection is this Herpa Etihad Airbus A20 Formula 1 livery from 2009 if I'm correct, so it's a very old model. Um, I'm really really happy to have this one in my collection, let's get to the model. And this is the model. As you can see, it's a quite old model, um, but a stunning one. Very beautiful model. Really happy to have this one. The next model in my collection is this Gemini Max um, Rockwell B1 Lancer um, from the Dice Air Force Base. I'm not really into military aircrafts, but I really like the B1 bomber, so I have to get this one. And this is the model out of the box. As you can see, very detailed, good model by Gemini Jets. And the funny part about this aircraft is that you can make it supersonic as well with the wings backwards. Be careful when you do this, it's quite fragile. Let's put it back into its uh, subsonic speed wing uh, configuration. Next up is this United States Air Force Boeing C-32 Alpha or a Boeing 757 configured for the United States uh, Air Force. And here you can see the model out of the box, also quite an old model. Um, bought this one from another collector. Um, very good model by Gemini Jets, as you can see, the model quality is very good here. Next up, we got this uh, Boeing Airbus A321 Neo from uh, Gemini Jets as well. And you can see the model, beautiful model. Also an older one, I think from 2018 to 2019. The next model of this collection is this Mongolian Airlines Boeing 767-300 from uh, GC Wings. And here you can see the model out of the box, beautiful model. I really like the Mongolian Airlines livery with the blue and the white and the yellow. So I really had to get this one since I also had it in, in 1 to 5 on scale like 10 years ago. And now I have the 1 to 4 on scale. So I'm really happy with this model. Next up we have this FedEx 777 freighter with the Panda livery. And here you can see the model, beautiful model. And from Phoenix models as well. Uh, I didn't tell you that before. Um, Really have, happy to have this one as well. Um, I have it for some time, approximately approximately 70 years now. I bought it from another collector in the Netherlands here. Next model is this Azul Airlines 803200 in this special livery. I don't know the name of this, but I think it's a two delivery. I really like blue aircraft, so I have a lot of them. And that's why I have to have this one. So let's unbox this uh, GC Wings. So I put some light on to show this model because it's quite dark here. Um, this also... Tudo livery, uh, Airbus A3200, beautiful Brazilian livery with the Brazilian flag over here. Awesome model. Next up is this Air Belgium Airbus A340-300. The model out of the box, beautiful model. Next up is this uh, Azerbaijan Airbus A340-600 and the Airbus A340-500, I have both of them. So this is the Airbus A340-600 out of the box, beautiful model. Really love the Azerbaijan livery. Here you can see the 340 absolutely beautiful as well. It's the same, just a little bit shorter. The next model in this uh, scale model collection is this Accorio Chupalef 204 here from NG Models. And here you can see the model out of the box, absolutely beautiful model. Sadly, Accorio is banned from most countries, but I would love to see them in other countries. I Besides, yeah, North Korea and China, of course. Next model is this TNT Boeing 757-200. As well as some other aircraft in my collection. This one sadly doesn't exist anymore. It was bought by FedEx a couple of years ago. And it is now flying for ASL, if I'm correct. Awesome aircraft, sadly, not in this livery anymore. So you can see the model out of the box. Beautiful model. Next model is the Singapore Airlines Everest 830-300 from Phoenix. And here you can see the model out of the box. Absolutely beautiful model. I really like Singapore Airlines. I have some models of them in my collection. You can see that later on in the video. But uh, the 330 is mainly used in Asia on the shorter routes. Next up is this KLM 777-300DR in the Orange Pride Libby from Aviation 400. 
And here you can see the model out of the box, beautiful model, awesome details done by Aviation Foreign. They put a lot of detail in their work because this model and other Aviation Foreign models are exceptionally good quality. Next model of my collection is Air Greenland Airbus 83200 from NG Models. And here you can see the model out of the box, beautiful model. Sadly, this one is replaced by an 83800neo. I have that one on order, order as well um, from GC Wings, if I'm correct. But uh, this one is also a very beautiful model. Next model is this Martin Air MD11 in the very old livery um, from Gemini Jets 2. And here you can see the model out of the box. Beautiful model, really happy with this one. I really like Martin Air and I'm sad that it's uh, fading away with uh, KLM, of course, but you know, I would love to see some more aircraft in the Martin Air livery. Next model is this Cafe Pacific Boeing 777-300ER. And until this day, I'm still wondering which manufacturer this is. I think it's GC Wing. And here you can see the model out of the box, beautiful model. Absolutely nailed it with every detail on this one. So very nice model. So next up is these four models from uh, Southwest. First one is the Colorado 1 737 from NG Models. We have the Texas 1 from Gemini Jets 737. We have the California 1 from Gemini Jets 737. And finally we have this the brown livery, I always call it, the Southwest 737 700. Um, it's the older livery. So here we have the California 1. Beautiful livery with the bear. The Texas 1. Awesome livery. The Colorado 1 from NG Models and the older brown livery from Gemini Jets. Next model is this Malaysian Airlines Boeing 777-300ER from Gemini Jets in the Freedom of Space livery. Here you can see the model out of the box. Absolutely beautiful model. Sadly, it crashed when it was shut down over Ukraine in 2014. Very sad. Next model is the Singapore Airlines Airbus A380-800 from GC Wings in the 50 years of Singapore livery. And here you can see the model out of the box. Beautiful model, absolutely nailed it by GC Wings in my opinion. Uh, maybe the nose could be a little bit better, but yeah, that's just a small detail in my opinion. Very nice. Next model is this Phoenix Models Qatar Airways Boeing 777-300 in the FC Barcelona livery. And here you can see it out of the box, beautiful model. Um, and here you can see the FC Barcelona part. Next model in this unboxing is this very old KLM Boeing 747-400. And here you can see the model. Please let me know what your favorite model is so far. Next model is this Eddie Hutt Airbus A340-600 in the Formula 1 2017 Abu Dhabi Grand Prix livery. Here you can see the model out of the box. Next model is the South African Link BAE-146 from JetX in 1.4 scale. And here you can see it out of the box. It's a very small airplane, but a very detailed one. Next model is a Tupolift U-154 from Aeroflot from Phoenix. And here you can see the model out of the box. Beautiful aircraft. Next up is this Antonov 124 from Volker Jnepper from Gemini Jets in the 1.4 scale. And here you can see the aircraft. Very big aircraft, only some small details is that the uh, left wing from this view the right wing is um, yeah slightly lower than the other wing and that's yeah something that irritates me but yeah it's a design fault um but overall beautiful model next up is this klm city hopper fokker 70 from uh, gemini jets and the antony fokker livery as you can see over here here you can see the aircraft out of the box as well as the south african uh, link this one is also very small but uh, beautiful the next model in my collection is this KLM Boeing 7710 in the 100 years of uh, KLM livery from Gemini Jets. And here you can see the model out of the box. Awesome model. Next up is this Alaska Airlines Boeing 737-900 in the honoring those who serve livery from Gemini Jets. And here you can see the model out of the box. Beautiful model. Next up is this Agreeland Boeing 757-200 from NG Models. And here you can see the model. Next up is this New Zealand Boeing 777-300ER in the All Blacks livery. And here you can see the model out of the box, a beautiful model, but an older one since this model doesn't feature any antennas or other things. Just very basic, but I uh, really like this one. Next up is this uh, Etihad Airways Boeing 787-9 Dreamliner in the Manchester City livery from NG Models. And here you can see the model out of the box, beautiful, awesome baby blue color. I really like this one. 
Next up is this Airbus A350-1000 from the Airbus factory, the first A350 made by Airbus. And this is the model out of the box. I really like aircraft and factory colors. I had an A380 from China Southern in my past reviews, but I sold it because, you know, I didn't like the color combinations. This one is way better. So that's why I keep this one. This one is very good. Next up is another KLM aircraft. Uh, this one is the MD-11, the Farwell colors. From the DC-2 to the MD-11, a journey of inspiration indeed. Uh, made by Phoenix Models. And here you can see the model out of the box. Beautiful, very detailed, awesome model. And next model is this Frontier Airbus A20 from Gemini Jets. And here you can see the model out of the box, beautiful model. As well as uh, some other models, I have this one for a very long time, so you may have seen this one in the previous reviews. Next up is this Hawaiian Boeing 717-200 from Gemini Jets as well. And here you can see the model, beautiful. Next up is this uh, Air New Zealand Boeing 737-200 in the old livery. And here you can see the aircraft out of the box, very old model, and the horizontal stabilizer in the back is a little bit loose, so that's, that's something I have to be careful with. Next up is this Airbus A230-743L, or also known as the Beluga XL from Airbus, made by GC Wings. And this is the aircraft. You can also configure it with an open door, but then it's a little bit wobbly and it uh, tends to tip over. So I uh, use the closed uh, configuration. Next up is this very old Gemini Jets 2 model from South African Airways, Airbus A340-600. And here's the model out of the box. As you can see, it's an old model. The nose and the cockpit is a little bit off. The uh, aircraft doesn't feature any antennas, but yeah, it's an old model. Uh, what do we expect? Not a lot, so we're very happy with this one. And next up is this Gulf Air Airbus 8030-200 in the uh, Formula 1 Grand Prix uh, of Bahrain 2008. As well as the previous model, this one is pretty old as well, as you can see in the nose. And no antennas. I think this model is, uh, as I said before, from 20, 2008. But it doesn't matter because it's still a stunning model. Next up is this Air New Zealand 777-200 from Dragon Wings. And you can see it out of the box, beautiful model. The second Dragon Wings model in my collection is this Finnair One World Airbus A340-300. And you can see the model out of the box, beautiful model. Really like the One World livery on this one. Next is Air New Zealand Boeing 777-300TR. Here you can see the model out of the box, absolutely beautiful of course. The next model is a Saudi Arabian Boeing 777-300TR in a Sky Team livery from Phoenix. And here you can see the model out of the box, beautiful Phoenix model. I really like the Sky Team livery, especially on this Saudi Arabia. Uh, 777, the grey with the yellow goldish logo really combined together in my opinion, so that's why I had to get this one. Next up is this EasyJet 737-300 in, uh, from Herpa. And here you can see the model. Very old model. Next up is this Boeing Airbus A330-300 from Phoenix Models. And you can see the model out of the box, beautiful model. Um, nothing to complain about. Next up is this Gemini Jet Qatar Airways Airbus A350-1000. And you can see the aircraft out of the box. I really like the Airbus A350-1000. I've got another one that just showed previously in this model collection. Next up is this Marinair Cargo MD-11. This is the final Martinair MD-11 that uh, flew from Bogota to Miami to London and to Amsterdam on the 26th and 27th of June 2016. And you can see the model out of the box, beautiful model. I kind of like this livery more than the previous one I just showed you, the older uh, livery. Uh, this one is better in my opinion. Next up is this Etihad uh, Boeing 779 in the Formula 1 2018 livery of Abu Dhabi uh, from GC Wings. And here you can see the aircraft out of the box, beautiful model. So yeah, let me know what you think about this one in comparison to my other Formula 1 liveries. I think this one looks kind of good, but you know, not so classic as the other ones. Next up is this Garuda Indonesia Boeing 777-300ER from Phoenix. And you can see the model out of the box, beautiful model by Garuda Indonesia and of course Phoenix models. It also features antennas, so that's a plus. So next up are the three Iceland Air Special liveries, the Boeing 757-300 from Gemini Jets in the 100 years livery from Iceland. Also reviewed the Iceland Air at Nayoku 80 years of aviation in Iceland livery, as well as this Hecla Aurora uh, Northern Lights Iceland Air 757-300 from Gemini Jets. So here's the first model, the Gemini Jets uh, at Nayoku uh, correction, uh, the uh, uh, Northern Lights Aurora Borealis livery. The Fatna Yoku Iceland Air 757 from Engie Models. 
and the 100 years of Iceland, uh, 757 300 from Gemini Jets. Next up is this Dark Angola Airlines Boeing 777 300ER from Phoenix. And you can see the model, beautiful orange with red. And the Angola flag is also beautiful in my opinion. I really like this model. Next up is this Kenya Airways Boeing 777 300ER from Phoenix. And you can see the aircrafts, a little bit of white, but uh, the tail makes everything good um, with this uh, beautiful colorful uh, tail. And the final 777 in my collection is this ANA Star Wars uh, BB-8 delivery from uh, Aviation 400. And you can see the aircraft. Awesome. Amazing details. Absolutely stunning model. And the final four models in my collection are the Singapore Airlines 747 400 from Herpa. And this is the aircraft. This is my first 1 to 4 skill aircraft I had. I collected this one, I think, back in 2012, 2013, when I was very young. Next up is this US Airways, Airbus A330-200 from NG Models. And here you can see the aircraft. NG Models always does a great job, so nothing to complain about. Awesome model, really like this one. And the final two models are this JDX 747 from TNT Airways. And here you can see the model, awesome model. The old TNT Airways livery as compared to the previous shown uh, TNT 75 in the newer livery. And the final model is this uh, Dreamlifter Boeing 747 400 uh, uh, Lima Charlie Foxtrot. From Jisoo Wings, and here you can see that out of the box, awesome model, just sadly that it doesn't open the back, but yeah, um, 1 to 100 skill it does, so maybe I have to get that one. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching, I really hope you liked this video, and I will do another video next year. Um, just to give you an update, I've got uh, 5 or 6 models on uh, pre-order. That's uh, the Air Belgium A330-900, the Delta Airlines Airbus A330-900 and Singapore Airlines Airbus A350, the United States Air Force, Air Force One um, and the Air Greenland A330-800. So yeah, thank you very much for watching, see you next time.